Howdy folks and welcome to Terra Firma Living. I'm your host Starshard Zero and today I'll be teaching you how to build a safe, sturdy, and aesthetically pleasing shelter to get you through your first couple of weeks in Terra Firma Craft. In the end it'll look something like this. Before we get started building a new shelter, we're going to need a couple of tools. We'll need at least one stone axe and a shovel. Once we've got those, we're going to need to chop down some trees. We'll need about three stacks of logs. I'll chop down these spruce trees and meet you back when I'm done. Now that we've got the logs, we can begin building our new shelter. We'll need to find a small hillside. I've chosen this hillside because it's close to fresh water, which will make it easier to stay hydrated. The first thing we'll need to do is make a five block wide incision into the side of the hill. This will form the back part of the house. Next we'll need to place logs to form the roof. I like to make my shelters a five by five square. Once the roof is complete, we can place some side walls. Finally, we place the door frame. Now that that's done, we'll need to excavate the dirt under our shelter so we can fit inside. You can leave the floor at too deep, but I like to dig out an extra third layer so it feels more spacious. The last thing we need to do is take the dirt we've excavated and place it over the roof like this. We'll want to cover all the exposed wood, except for the front door frame, since if we try to do that, the dirt will collapse and block the entrance. You should have enough dirt from the excavation to cover the whole structure, but if you don't, you can always borrow some dirt from the surrounding area. After all the dirt's been placed, our new shelter is complete. This type of shelter is known as a dugout or pit house. It's one of the most ancient types of human housing known to archaeologists. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you again on another episode of Terra Firma Living.